As the 2023 High Rocks World Championships approaches, the anticipation is palpable. Heading to the last major race in Manchester, we will try to learn more about our Elite 15 athletes, the real title contenders. Michael Sandbag is a top High Rocks athlete, overcoming his weaknesses in lunges and wall balls to deliver impressive performances in the first four workouts. With his fierce determination and athleticism, he is one of the main title contenders for this year's World Championships, and he has a good reason for this. Let's see why. The pressure's on me because it's my hometown, I'm an hour away, I've got my whole gym coming, my family, my wife's family. It's massive for me, that race. Um, I'm going to have to go to a place probably mentally, physically that I've never been before. I'm dreading it and I'm loving it. I'm looking forward to it. It's just the pressure's going to be colossal for me. Uh, if I could win that, honestly, it would just be something in my life that would just be the pinnacle, I think, definitely. Um, I've always done sports and things and, um, like I say, I lost my dad about in 2009. And yeah, he was always obsessed with sports and pushing me and it would just be out of this world if, if I could do something like that and, you know, maybe the thought of him maybe looking down on me, possibly seeing me win that and for my mum as well, it would just be, it would just be something that I can't even describe the feeling. Megan Jacoby is one of the most consistent racers. Despite a couple of miscounted running laps in her races this year, she's determined to secure her first Elite 15 race victory at the upcoming 2023 High Rocks World Championships. Can she achieve her goal and take home the goal? Learning how everyone else races is important too. You have to know yourself, but you also have to kind of know what your competition's gonna do. Um, Cause otherwise you can make some fatal mistakes at times. So, um, but you know, there's money on the line and that's important for all of us athletes, I'm sure. You know, it helps fund more races. So yeah, but yes, ultimately it would be to peak for, for the world championships. Letting myself down is probably my biggest fear, but I don't, I feel like I know how hard I've been working to be successful in this. So I don't, I, I, I hope that that never becomes, you know, a thing I experience. But yeah, probably letting myself and maybe like my daughter, like disappointing my daughter somehow down, I guess. Um, otherwise, you know, I'm not, someone that's trying to prove anything to anyone else like I'm just I'm here trying to prove things to like to me you know so that's the biggest thing looking forward to seeing you next week as we continue to highlight more title contenders in the world's toughest fitness race high rocks